We all know how important marketing and branding is to the success of a company or organization, but so many nonprofits can't afford or don't have the resources to get quality creative work. Forge 54 set out to change that. Forge 54 was created to build a way for young marketing professionals and students to create a difference in their community. Donating the most valuable thing they have to offer, their creativity, experience, and skills. With everyone's crazy schedules, jobs, and obligations, we decided that we could be way more effective in donating our services if we were hyper-focused for 54 hours straight. So we gathered our Forge leaders and searched local nonprofits in Orange County to find the perfect fit for our first Forge weekend. After many phone calls and meetings, we found the OC Food Bank, a local food bank in our community for people in need. They are very generous, but had poor communication outlets and outdated branding, to say the least. The Orange County Food Bank is really an opportunity for the public to express their generosity, both in terms of the, the food that they provide, the volunteer service they provide, and then the funding they provide. We're an organization that can help upwards to 400 other nonprofit organizations get food if we can get additional food in. At this particular time in our history, our single greatest need is absolutely the need for additional food. And in order to do that, we need real recognition of who we are and how we operate. We know how to quietly give food out there, but we don't know how to toot our own horn. So as a result of that, we're not on the radar of a lot of mainstream companies. Upon further research, we found that the OC Food Bank directs most of their resources towards food bank operations, leaving very little time or money for marketing efforts. We set forth a strategy to ensure marketing success for them. The Forge leaders were able to inspire 47 individuals to join the team on a mission to help rebrand and remarket the OC Food Bank. I just want to thank everyone for showing up. This is an amazing journey we're about to start. Each team has just 54 hours to complete their planning, creative, and execution of their projects. I'm looking forward to working with each and every one of you. Other than that, if you guys have any questions, let's get started. And the countdown began. We split up into three groups, video, design, and digital, with only 54 hours to complete our established goals. The video team, led by Alex Meter, set out to produce two brand new commercials for the OC Food Bank and an animated infographic. My name is Alex Meter, and I am the leader of the video team for the Forge 54 project. My goal for the videos is to create one longer video that really connects people to the OC Food Bank and the idea of investing in the community for the future. Right now, we're just kind of starting to piece together the story cut of our main video. We're also trying to get ready for tomorrow when we're going to be shooting B-roll at the facility and at another local uh, soup kitchen facility. The design team took on the daunting challenge of rebranding the OC Food Bank, including a new logo, slogan, and collateral. Only a few hours into the first day, and the logo and branding concepts were almost complete. The design team came together to discuss. We have um, two directions that we're, that we're exploring, and the first one is the cyclical direction. It's talking about how you're investing into your community and that eventually it's going to come back to you and it's going to profit you. The other direction is the plate idea, and it's the idea that we are bringing food to the table. I think the infinity sign one kind of says everything about the messaging that we're going to. I think that's the stronger idea. My name is Paul Zappia, and I am a member of the design team as a graphic designer. We ended up going with the cyclical logo and we're going to narrow down how we can make that logo more refined and then underneath that we are going to start creating secondary elements for that logo and then we are going to take those assets and sort of set them throughout different elements that the rest of this campaign is going to need. Led by Dalip Jaggi, the digital team worked closely with the design team to start working on a new website, donation system, and mobile application something the OC Food Bank had never had before. My name is Dalip Jaggi, and I'm part of the web team at Forge 54. So we're going to make the full website. We're also looking to expand their donation system and their blogging system, as well as the, just the overall user interaction of the website. With the design team finalizing a logo structure and the digital team finishing up website wireframes, the new direction was taking form. Day one was successful with the completion of a logo structure, new website wireframes, and the filming of all interviews for the commercials. It's about eight hours already in Forge 54. It's been fun, it's been exciting, and right now it's uh, the flow of creativity is really coming through. The next step is for us to start development and make sure we execute. Coming from tonight until Sunday, that's when the crunch time hits because we have to make sure all the dreams and ideals that we're making at this moment are realistic and that we can complete a deadline. I think we're already above uh, where we should be. The team got a few hours of sleep knowing that they wouldn't get that privilege the next day. But that didn't stop the video team from getting an early start at sunrise of day two. The video team started by filming on-site at the OC Food Bank to capture the organization in action. 
back at Forge 54 headquarters. The gears were already turning. We're here day two at Forge 54, and right now we're in the process of putting together the website and laying all the visuals and content together. First, the web team came up with all the priorities that we wanted people to, to do on the website. The design team did a great job of implementing all of our ideas. They came back with some uh, design mock-ups. Now we're uh, coding all the functionality. So right now we're all talking about this rebranding, this first this first engagement that everyone's going to have. Yeah. Why don't we kind of like create almost a package, it's like first time donation involvement that kind of caters to that, that kind of goes through all the angles of being involved, communicating with the OC Food Bank and donating money, they can kind of like, that will be the call to action. The teams working together is, is the biggest part of what Forge 54 is all about, bringing the different agencies, the different age groups, the different people together that have never worked together to really make something bigger than what they could have done on their own. Halfway through day two, the video team finished filming and began editing footage for the new commercials. The digital team was hard at work coding the new donation system. And the design team was integrating graphics into the new website and social media platforms. Tons of work was being completed, but there were still many obstacles for the team to overcome. Not to mention they were quickly running out of time. A couple challenges right now that we're running into are color. You know, color is a big part in what you want to say, how you want to say it. So right now we're debating whether we go with a more extravagant approach or if we stay more conservative, use one color as opposed to two colors. But when we do combine the two colors in a gradient form, how we have it in the logo, uh, it becomes a little bit more complex and modern. Uh, that's a problem because Orange County as a whole is a little bit more conservative and the people that we are targeting are businesses and higher up leaders. Visually, they both look great, but it's just a matter of what the message that we're trying to say is. The struggle is, de is uh, development at this point. Just because we're in a short window, and there's a lot of stages that go on when you're developing a website. So we have to make sure that we finish this up in a timely manner where we can also add the product. That way the OC Food Bank has this on Sunday where it's turnkey and they don't need to add anything to it. We have the big concepts done and now it's just about execution. Everyone here is very passionate about what they're doing and everyone wants everything to be perfect. And so we're not gonna just throw up a website. We want these to be made proper. I think we are going to start get hitting that fatigue. You can see that teams get a little weird. <laughs> I'm feeling great right now, man. 19 more hours, and we're, we're all, I think, still really motivated. Um, half the team, they've been pumping out the motion stuff, so they're really excited, and it's looking really positive. There's really no stress. We're all excited to just finish this thing up and produce the best thing we can. The team worked through the night as day two blended into day three. A lot needed to be done still, but spirits were high. At the end of day two, the Forge team had successfully completed the new logo and branding for the OC Food Bank, the development and design for the new website, and the filming and editing of two of the commercials. We've been extremely efficient and things have been going really well. Um, you know, I'm feeling pretty good. We've had a, a, a few hurdles uh, as to be expected, but I think given the circumstances, we're doing well. We're gonna finish, we're gonna finish. We're gonna finish, yeah. The digital team was rushing to finish the donation system and finalize push notifications on the mobile app with only a few hours to go. down to the wire, but the Forge team made it happen. The leaders gathered their materials and prepared for the presentation to the OC Food Bank just minutes before the countdown ended. The teams were excited and nervous because this would be the first time in 54 hours that the OC Food Bank would see any of their work. The design team took to the stage first to present the OC Food Bank's new logo, slogan, and branding collateral. We wanted to get rid of kind of that um, perception of, you know, when you donate to somebody needy, it's to somebody that can't help themselves. And we wanted to change that, you know, when you donate to the community. At the end, you're only helping yourself. That kind of commitment just pretty much benefits you in the long term. So you're not investing in, say, the poor. You're investing in yourself and you're investing in your community. Of course, we can't just make this logo and leave it there. So uh, what we 
did for you guys today is we um, started mocking up how your logo would look on a bunch of different applications and how we would take that logo and apply it to several different places. What we started uh, thinking about as well is how we play on the message of that tribal image, that, that local pride. So we have the iHeart OC approach, but we also have this locals only shirt line. What's really great about this is it has this little prideful attitude to it. And it's also, you know, that cycle is within the locals, you know, of this community. And it, and it very clearly promotes that. You know, promote that OC pride. Like this is our city, so we are the local team. This weekend has been a whirlwind of an experience. I've done everything from designing parts of web pages to helping with animation to building a brand, building this awesome package that we were able to hand off to a client and really did something that I never thought could be done in a matter of 54 hours, but with a team of amazingly talented and dedicated people can come to life. The video team was up next to present their three commercials, including two live action videos and one animated infographic. Our goal was with our project to really tell you guys' story and work with the, all the other teams to try to create a message that really meshes well with everything else we're trying to say and really conveys your guys' brand and where you guys are going to go in the future. The idea that we kind of tried to latch on was that idea of investing in our community and sort of serving our future through that and how people can be involved in helping you guys do it on an even greater scale. I feel really good. Our video project came together extremely well. I was worried at some points it's a lot to ask to try to do something of this scale in the amount of time we had, but our team was really incredible and we didn't sleep much and we worked a lot and we got it done and I'm really proud of what we made and it was really awesome to be a part of this and be a part of presenting so much really cool work to this organization that really deserves it. The last team to hit the stage was the digital team to present the new website, donation system, and mobile app. So initially, I was I land ocfoodbank.com or .org, and I would say I can type in ten dollars, twenty dollars, but then I'm kind of stuck at that amount. If a user says I want to spend twenty dollars, you can't get any more. You can't persuade them or justify what they're spending is for. You can inform them, but not doing the actual transaction when it's in their mind. So here we're saying five dollars, and somehow people say I guess it's like a kid, like feeds one kid. But if you click plus and click like two or three times, you then start seeing how many people you're actually feeding, whether it be family or kids, and what kind of math goes on involved in that. Then you kind of go to the donation. It kind of expedites, informs, and uh, just kind of, once again, justifies the value of the money that they're spending. Okay, let's, let's take it to uh, another level. So the, the internet is great. Digital communication is key. We all know this. What we want to provide is a, a mobile application for you to kind of also get, in, get involved with your, your audience and inform them when you need more volunteers or what events are coming up. There'll always be a new notification here. So if every time you update a status, the phone will get alerted, kind of in a way to say, we'll look, we have an event October 13th, we're looking for volunteers. They click OK, they see that, they can click easily volunteer and it kind of goes from there. When we started, and even before that, I've been waiting 54 hours to come to this moment to show what we can create and what our talents are capable of. And for it to be here to finally get the reviews and opinions from OC Food Bank, I think that that meant a lot to me and I'm really going to cherish this moment. I know you only hear, heard really from the leaders here. We had 47 people donate their time for the weekend with over 2,583 hours of donated time, which when we kind of talk to everyone about their companies, that allocates over $161,000 worth of services donated in the last 54 hours. Guys, can't wait for the next one, and thanks, uh, thanks for coming out. Forge 54 is a, a force to be reckoned with. I've never seen anything quite like this. This is what every nonprofit should be uh, going through. What I saw tonight is rather amazing. I saw a product come out of 54 hours that actually if I thought about it I probably didn't think was possible. There really aren't any limits to what you can do as long as you just keep working and keep grinding at it. You can get things done that you never in a million years would have thought you actually could. It was awesome. Every single one of our members took the OC Food Bank as their own and really made it something that they cared about and thought was really special. The model that we created, it's become a community, it's become a concept, it's become a cause that is, is bigger than any one element of the group. No one single member could have done this, and by putting everyone together in this cause and kind of the pressures that we created, 
We created something that wasn't possible in any other environment. I'm just proud of everything we did.